All right, so your name and your job. Uh, Steve Parker, and I'm manager of design and construction for the Simcoe County School Board. All right, and what are you responsible for for the board? For the board, I am responsible for all forms of construction. So anything from small interior renovations up to brand new school. Thank you. No problem. So what do you want students to take away from today? Okay, so when I thought about this tour, most of the work that we were doing in class is all light construction. We weren't doing a lot of heavy construction just due to cost of materials for students to practice with. So I thought it, instead of going somewhere, uh, we're in school every day for so many months out of the year for four years of our lives. Let's check and see what makes the building work. You've all seen the, those little wood slats that are in the front entrance up on the high walls. And this back here, this spaghetti string stuff is called tectum. And those holes in the block, that's actually intentional. It's not that they miss stuff. There's actually rock sole insulation in that block. So when you guys are yelling in here, there's a performance on stage or something like that, that's actually absorbing all that sound and not kicking it back in a reverberation so you don't get that echo. So, what you guys don't see in this building is rooms like this, and this is what keeps it open and keeps it alive. And like I say, if some of this stuff goes down, it's not catastrophic. By the building code, we can't keep you in here, but it's your ventilation system, it's your fresh air. This building's unique from a lot of other buildings we have. You have a ground source heat system. So we're pulling fluid out of the earth, like 300 feet down out of the earth, which is warm, and we're heating the school with it. Um, so this is a very high-powered electrical panel, but really not too much different from what's probably in your houses. And there are hundreds of these panels throughout the building. 